You know, in the world full of men, we have something called red pilling, which I guess that freaks out every single person in this entire planet. And honestly, I already made a video talking about the death of red pill because I really think it's just dying out anyways. Interestingly enough, Pokimane has something to say about that. Yes, unfortunately, we are talking about Pokimane. Now, what is her brain dead take on it? Of course, she thinks that, you know, red pilling people are... Uh, danger to society and all that stuff. Blah blah blah. Booga wooga wooga. That that's her boogeyman scare. Like booga wooga wooga. Watch out for the men. Booga wooga wooga. Look, rice fields are scary. Red pill men are not. You know it's funny because she blames prepubescent little boys and the manosphere red pill bullshit, and is ditching Twitch. You know how brain dead do you have to be to go into that kind of territory to think? Oh, you know, Twitch has a bunch of red pill people. I gotta leave it so I can bolster my audience. No, in fact, it's the quite opposite. Re YouTube has a giant, has a giant red pill kind of like category. You can find so many people. I say YouTube and Kick are the two platforms where you will find all the red pill audiences you could ever want. Twitch does not. If I were to go ahead and stream my screen on YouTube and just look up twitch.tv, I would immediately get age-gated. I'm not joking, I will get age-gated. Twitch has just become the second coming of Pornhub, right? Like how there was a second coming of Jesus, there's a second coming of Pornhub, and it's called twitch.tv, where you find a bunch of female streamers with their like, you know, <laughs> or their ass hanging out. <laughs> look, there are certain words I cannot say Without getting age gated man <laughs> but with that being said <laughs> um i find that laughable and uh, hilarious look if you want to avoid the red pill audience get off the internet that's that's all i have to say there are people that are going to make fun of you there are people that are going to go ahead and just you don't like the red pill audience i could care less honestly if you don't want the red pill audience then you know it is what it is but you are being retarded here that's like me saying I don't want to surround myself with porn content, hence I'm going to go over to Pornhub. What do you mean? <laughs> like, this is the most brain dead take, and honestly, I'm going to be honest, a bunch of red pillars are going to go ahead and see this and make fun of this constantly. Pokemon is not doing herself a favor, I'm going to be honest. Look, you want female viewers, good for you. You want to do that while going ahead and destroying your... Male viewership, uh, to be honest, maybe the people that like Pokemon on the Twitch side that are men might like that. <laughs> they might be masochists that just want to get stomped on. Look, you do you. Your kink is your, your kink. But, like, look, <laughs> it ain't helping you out here on YouTube. That's for damn sure. You'll be killing your audience before you come to YouTube, especially uh, anything that would give you any leg up. But with that being said... <laughs> Of course, here comes Game Star with the. Oh! <laughs> Bro, take my rice hat, it'll look better. Oh! <laughs> yes, it is shocking news for a grown ass man to make about a 20 something year old woman at this point. <laughs> Fucking Meme Star, man. Cars have four wheels. Oh! <laughs> Stop coming at you, dude. It's too funny to come at you. Anyways, I'm getting myself distracted. I was supposed to look up shit about Pokemon. <laughs> but this Pokemon shit is just so stale and bad. I get it. You want to go ahead and, you know, live your life, go on different platforms, make your money. Good for you. Like, seriously, good for you. But I'm telling you right now, this does nothing for you to go ahead and blast your audience like this. And frankly speaking... I feel like the move she's making could potentially kill her career if she's not careful. Now, will she actually kill her career? I don't think so, right? Then again, I could be wrong. Um, but with that being said, we have to see how far she's willing to take dissing her own audience to really get a grasp of, you know, what her audience will be like. Anyways, with that being said, and with my cat <laughs> screaming in the background, this has been me, the most practical of Asians, or the practical Asian. It's there in the name. And like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and practically, I could care less about Pokemon.